lay off the crack. Greetings and salutations, lords and ladies. Welcome to Pansy Warrior Princess. I am your hostess, your mistress with the most is Pansy Nader Schmidt. Uh, it is exceptional to have you here in the throne room. Uh, please give a nice warm welcome to my security staff. Rinse and repeat. So, let me tell you a tale of woe, lords and ladies. Gather round, gather round the throne. Uh, I recently had my appendix removed, and in case any of you are contemplating going under the knife, I just wanted to give you a couple of tips about your post-operative experience. Uh, the first one is whatever sort of recovery timetable you're given uh, for when you'll feel yourself again, just go on ahead and add a week. I was told that between three and four days, I would be my warrior princess self again. And let me tell you that day four uh, was the day that I split my incision open, which was every bit as horrifying and gruesome as you may well imagine. Uh, the other thing I want to tell you is if you're having anything done on your torso, apparently you run a risk of having air enter your abdomen. And if they sew you up and that's still in there, it's going to cause what I was described as some mild discomfort in the neck and shoulders. Why the neck and shoulders? I don't know. But I wanted to translate the phrase some mild discomfort because what it actually means is uh, excruciating pain. And I didn't know that. I, I was unaware. But I didn't want you to be ignorant uh, as I was. And so I would just like to give a personal uh, huzzah to Dr. Cut and Slice and say, I hope our paths never cross again. We're going to move on. What I'm playing tonight is Mass Effect for the Xbox 360. Uh, this is a game, it reminds me a lot of Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. And if you know me at all, you know that means I really liked it because I love an RPG. Um, I, I love creating my own character. This game was no exception. I had a lot of fun doing that. She looks just like me, as I'm sure you'll notice. Um, there's some playability issues with this game. You know, there's no auto lock during combat. Why that is, I, I frankly don't understand. But I have to assume that the few, you know, sort of weird glitches in this game will get uh, uh, fixed for the sequel. It's kind of a funny game. No one knew what to expect from this, and I was actually pleasantly surprised. If you don't like a lot of reading during your games, this is not the game for you. It is, you know, sort of a novel. Um, but I thought that the plot was really good and the sort of supporting character subplots, I, I thought that they were great. So uh, I give this game four battle axes and I, I, I think the sequel is going to be incredible. In the distance, I see my faithful falcon serendipity with today's viewer mail. Nicely done. Serendipity, I hope you enjoyed your holiday. All right. PWP. PWP. Are you down with PWP? Yeah, you know me. All right, sorry. Uh, my friends think you're a witty cross of Xena, Red Sonia, and Elvira. I say you have twice the attitude and half the talent of these actresses. Half the talent. Please elaborate on the origins of your character, Finch. Well, Finchy, uh, why didn't your friend send in a viewer mail? Uh, I certainly like him more than I like you. I mean, I am not equipped to uh, evaluate my talent versus the talent of those fine ladies that you mentioned uh, in your viewer mail. It's just, I, can't, I don't roll like that. And uh, as far as the origins of my character, I mean, why, why do humans exist? What are we on the earth for? Which came first, the warrior or the princess? Who can say? These, these are complex uh, questions, and I cannot characterize the nature of my character. What I can say is that this viewer mail perfectly encapsulates the downside of being a celebrity. And, and that is that people, when anonymous, feel like they can just say whatever nasty stuff uh, 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 they want to say without any sort of um, consequences. So here's a consequence for you, Finchie. You, sir, are a jackass. A jackass. Lords and ladies, in case you've been under a rock, uh, uh, the Pansy Warrior Princess Show is live five nights a week, Sunday, Wednesday uh, at 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time at www.livevideo.com. Come and check me out. Uh, uh, we can chat, because who doesn't want to chat with a warrior princess? I, everybody does. Lords and ladies, as always, I would like to end with a quote from my hero, Mr. Oscar Wilde, and he said, if you want to tell people the truth, make them laugh. Otherwise, they'll kill you. And that, lords and ladies, is why I called Finchie a jackass. Because jackass is hilarious. Lords and ladies, good night and a good morrow. So it would have been
don't know, if Greg and Marcia had gotten it on, it wouldn't have been, you know, I mean, unsavory, yes, illegal, no. Here we come, walking down the street, I get the funniest looks, that's true, I get the funniest looks from everyone we meet, hey hey, we're the woo going a little high there. Oh, well, I know the song, Secret, well, you know, I had a friend who thought it was Secret Asian Man. <laughs> ah, that's for you, I have no fish, Secret Asian Man.